and a Tennyson, certified by WeatherAid for the most accurate forecast in the Ozarks. Well, good morning and happy Tuesday. Temperatures continuing to tumble down closer and closer to the teens this morning. Right now we're sitting at 20 degrees calm winds out there. You can see that uh, nobody's out quite yet because it's 615. But when you do head out the door, make sure you have that big jacket temperatures down in Branson now at 19 degrees. Now the good news is because the winds are so calm, the feels like temperatures are the actual temperatures. So that's great news. As we head into today, this high pressure system is going to continue to build into our region. So the clouds that you're seeing maybe in Lake Ozark over near Eminence down through Salem, those are going to be clearing out. We do have cold weather this morning. The good news is we are finally going to be warm up slightly as we head into this afternoon and especially into tomorrow. Also, take a look back in Texas that snow, even some wintry mix. That is a potential in our seven day forecast. No, not that what you're seeing. But later on this week, you can see where that cloud coverage is. Temperatures are warmer, 30 degrees up in Lake Ozark, Camdenton over in Rolla, 29 in Fort Wood. And then as you head over towards the west at 21 in Joplin, today is going to be a great day to take out your dog. I think that this picture uh, represents this well because we do have the potential for some snow showers in the forecast. You can tell Duke loves going outside playing in the snow. I read that he loves going to Nathaniel Green as well. The the only reason I gave it a yellow paw for 8 and 10 a.m. is just because it is going to be a little bit chilly out there, especially for the walkers. And then as we head into this afternoon, the green paw because the sunshine is going to be coming back out and temperatures are going to be warming up as well. As we head throughout today, this is 12 p.m., so maybe a few puffy clouds here and there. Mostly sunny skies, though, clear skies as we head into our overnight hours. Temperatures today warming up to 49 degrees here in Springfield. A few 50s sprinkled throughout. Very calm winds from the south. As we head into tonight, temperatures once again going to be flirting with that freezing mark. So just to be safe, go ahead and bring in those plants from the cold and protect them. As we head into Thursday, we do have a chance for some strong two severe storms, mainly in our far northern counties of Arkansas and our far western counties of Arkansas as well. That's just a marginal risk that does include Bentonville, Fayetteville and Harrison. And this is why we do have a cold front, a very powerful cold front that's going to be coming through mild and wet throughout Thursday. Also, it's going to be pretty breezy as well. Then on the back side of this, we could even be seeing some snow showers. I know March 14th snow showers, but hey, it's the weather, right? As we head into this weekend, temperatures 15 to 20 degrees below average for this time of year. So yes, that is frigid for March weather. As we head into St. Patrick's Day, temperatures are going to be affected by this cold front 40 degrees as we head into our seven day forecast. The good news is 62 degrees tomorrow, 62 on Thursday. And then as we head into this weekend, well, bundle up folks, 39 degrees on Saturday. Jesse? Oof, it's going to be chilly. Can't wait for